Hi everyone, it's Chris. Welcome to my dollhouse. And today I'm here with Faith, Hope, Charity and Grace with a message for you from the goddesses. So I'm hoping we will be able to share a message together that resonates and brings in a positive change for us. But remembering it is a general reading, so if it doesn't resonate with you, let it go. But if it does, take on board what sounds fair and true to you and leave the rest. So, first of all, faith. With the Oracle of the Goddesses. We have Hecate, Goddess of Mysteries. Her head. Things are not what they seem. Motives, beliefs and information must be kept secret. There can be no sign of what is really going on. What will it take to accomplish your goal without interference? You, too, may be the target of seduction. Passions may try and overrule logic. So beware of enticing involvements that you may later regret. So think seductively with the situation at the moment. Oh, what does that mean? Hope. Hecat again. Her heart fill renewed. Defeat and despair try to rob us of hope and paralyze our actions. Let yet within them is the power of nothing less than the great mystery of life itself. The time of defeat is the most fertile time to sow the seeds of future successes. Surviving what does not destroy our resolve makes us stronger and more confident. Do not give up on yourself or life. So feel renewed. And charity. Hecat again. Her home. Make big changes. Face your fear of the unknown. Fundamental changes must take place as you progress towards the goal you desire. The process has already started. The present moment is your point of power. Use your power to change now. You cannot change another, but the envy of good results often provokes change in even the most rigid. Hmm. So someone might follow your lead as well. And Grace, the voice of reason. I trust that my intuition is always leading me in the right direction. So thank you. Faith, hope, charity and grace. And until next time guys, many blessings.